Great God in heaven. Heavenly Father. Father, first of all, we realize that you are God. Father God, I thank you so much um, for you being huge. start here in Paris by thanking you for your presence in the midst of a thousand French people and people from all over Europe who are coming to think about the past and to admire the, the works of the past. Father, we are able to stand here and admire your presence, acknowledge that you represent the reality of what is right and true and good, and that we have access to that. We thank you. Um, Father, there are many, many things that uh, the French people have walls up against even thinking about God um, or thinking about a relationship with you. And I pray that uh, your words would be on our lips as we meet people here in France. And uh, Lord, I pray that you would soften their hearts, that you would help them to understand that there's a difference between religion and faith in you. Father God, I pray that the gospel be presented to them in such a way so that they can understand it and understand that it's not a way of life, but it's a life-changing message. We've met people that are afraid to get married because the divorce rate is so high that they are certain that they will end up in tragedy. I pray, Lord, that you would help them to have faith in you, a trust in you to find the right mate for them. Father, I pray specifically for the local believers. It's just difficult, Father, to be a Christian here in, in France. So eternal God, we thank you then for the privilege of being able to pray, being able to share the prayers of having them go out from Paris around in France and around the world so that all people may understand the value of the French people. Help us then, O oh God, to present you in a recognizable way, in a way that can be appreciated through their eyes, which is a work that only your spirit can perform. And we ask this in Jesus Christ's name.